The West is calling for a negotiation, but they don't have realistic uh, expectations. They say right up front, there can be no negotiation until Russia withdraws from the four territories that they've absorbed into Russia. And constitutionally, Putin can't say, I'm going to give it up. I'm sorry, world. Russia absorbed 20 percent of Ukraine. Blame the United States. Blame NATO. Blame Ukraine for starting this conflict and for failing to negotiate a peace settlement back on April 1st. But now you're trying to undo something at a negotiating table that, frankly speaking, the Ukrainian military can't do on the battlefield and NATO can't do it on the battlefield. Russia stopped your offensive. They destroyed the NATO proxy army. and They're building up their forces. Russia's going to finish this war the way war should be finished, by like defeating the enemy. Scott, when, yes, you, when you say that uh, that Ukraine and NATO and the U.S. started this conflict, people will say to that, well, what are you talking about? It was Russia that invaded back in February. So how do you respond to that? I, I respond February 2014, uh, not February 2022. That's when the conflict started. That's when the United States and the European Union uh, foisted this coup d'etat in Kiev, the Maidan revolution. But it was a Maidan coup that ousted the uh, elected, duly elected leader, Viktor Yanukovych, replaced him with this ultra-nationalist, Nazi-sympathizing, hand-picked government of the West that then carried out you know, basically cultural genocide against ethnic Russians. Uh, what they did in Odessa, damning a trade building with 150 people setting on fire and cheering and clapping as 84 burned to death. Then they did the rape of Mariupol. What they did to Mariupol is a crime. Nobody's talking about it. And then they started to do that to the rest of the Donbass. And the ethnic Russians said, no more. This shall not happen. They stood up. Russia intervened on the side, not militarily, but providing support for these ethnic Russians. But Russia sought a diplomatic solution. This is why in 2015, so-called Normandy format, Germany and France got together, negotiated with the, Russia, uh, with the Ukrainians, the Russians observing this Minsk II agreement. 